Democrats from across Arizona are watching the national convention together from home. Democracy was never meant to be transactional. You give me your vote. I think the idea of a virtual convention um, felt really weird and felt really awkward. Um, though I have found it to be super entertaining. Mary Darling, chair of the Santa Cruz Democratic Party, attended her friend's watch parties this week and is hosting her own for the final night. And I've heard so many folks that normally wouldn't have watched um, are watching and they're finding it really interesting. Organizers at Mission for Arizona coordinated close to 200 virtual watch parties this week. Patrick Gage is the regional organizing director for the East Valley. You know, you look at what is the core of an event, like why do people enjoy going to somebody's house or going to a, a field office and watching the convention together? It's they enjoy talking with each other. Party attendees watch the convention live together and then can talk over Zoom or message through the chat based platform Brand Live. Although the goal is to reach as many voters as possible, Gage says what makes the format effective is more parties and shorter invite lists. What the smaller parties allows us to do is actually even have parties that focus even more exclusively on someone's own kind of friend group or their own like geographic area so we can reach people that we wouldn't have been able to reach before. That pays off in communities like Nogales, Arizona. A lot of us that are in rural counties in Arizona, this is actually working out better for us. Darling says the virtual yeah. events are yeah. more accessible. When we've hosted in-person events, we are very conscious of the time of day and the time of year, frankly because monsoon season driving on you know, two lane highways with minimal lighting is not helpful to bring people to an event. For the attendees and organizers, the 2020 convention stands out from the rest because of one key difference, access. Access is really important because everyone's voice matters and we don't wanna say, all right, well, if you can't you know, pay for the ticket to get out to Milwaukee, then I guess you just don't get to experience the convention. That's not. That's not what Democrats should stand for. In Phoenix, Kylie Cochran, Cronkite News.